Hi, my name is Johnny Abelak. I'm 24 years young. I like long walks on the... I'm an actor. <laughs> that is all. <laughs> yeah, he's my brother, but <laughs> we ain't close. Ain't like we grew up together or, or nothing. Ain't like I'm going around his house every Christmas singing Silent Night. Shit, I didn't even know the fucker existed till I was 14. I'm coming out of school one day, right? And I see this immigrant kid waiting there. He's looking at me, see, but I don't think nothing of it. People are often looking at me, you know? <laughs> I got striking features or something. <laughs> anyway, after that, everywhere I go, I see a man, this immigrant kid. He's like, he's like my fucking shadow, man. My, my, my little immigrant shadow. I walk, he walks. I stop, he stops. Eventually, I just stop and fucking stare at him. See, like this. I'm like, okay, shorty, spill. He's got, he's got this, this posh little voice, man. And he's like, he's like, I know you. You're Nigel, aren't you? I'm like, yeah, I know who the fuck I am. Who the fuck are you? And then he's like, my name's Karim. I think we might be related. I'm like, yeah? He's like, yeah, I think you're my brother, Nigel. I'm like, go away, kid. I ain't got no brother. But he just stands there, right? This, this sweet little kid. And, and then he go, listen to this. Then he go, neither do I, but I think you might be him. Neither do I, but I think you might be him. He must have heard his uncles talking, see? Laughing about his old man, going on about Papa's little white boy. <laughs> That's what they call him, Papa. Like, like he's the big daddy or something. Like, like he's got baby mamas all around shop. Like he's some kind of Mac. He's a smart kid. Anyway, after that, I'm like, fuck off, kid. I ain't your brother. I ain't no immigrant, am I? But then I tell my mother. I know from her face, man. I, I know from her silence. I, I know from those little tar eyes. That kid be telling the truth. It's like, it's like when I was little and, and I'd be going to school and people would be shouting, immigrant, 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 immigrant. Hey, immigrant, immigrant. And I'm looking around, but I don't see no immigrant. They're shouting at me, see? And I'm like, I'm like, I'm fucking Canadian, man. I know immigrant. They was right. They was right. They knew me better than I knew myself. Immigrant. Nigel the immigrant. Hello. <laughs> who am I as an artist? As an artist, I'm someone who loves the nuances and characters. I enjoy how circumstances can form a character. Some of my favorite characters are villains, like the Joker from The Dark Knight or Killmonger from Black Panther, because you can sympathize with them, but they're the villain. They're based, based off the nuances. I also enjoy goofy characters, funny characters, because I like the joy that it can bring to an audience. As a dancer, I'm a very physical actor, and the way that those characters tend to move is just like, woo. So that's me as an artist in a nutshell. People often ask, where do you see yourself in like five, 10 years? Oddly specific. Um, I'm not someone who usually likes to think of the future. <laughs> I like to be present and in the moment. Ideally in five years, you know, I'd be still doing this, you know, maybe making some money. That would be nice to live, um, traveling, but I, I just want to be able to do this as long as I can because um, this is what I'm passionate about. Coming into the AMP program, I was someone who struggled a lot with finding where I fit in in the theater community um, identity. And I think the AMP program has given me as an artist not only the resources to kind of pursue this career post AMP, like post showcase everything to have the tools I need to work in this industry, but also just a sense of community. I feel like everyone in the ensemble, the mentors, 
uh, the guests, everyone involved in the program has been really helpful, really uplifting and a good vibe to be around. So hopefully I still get to work with these people in the future. <laughs> um, but I think it's given me just a good energy and the skills required going forward to continue to do this happily. <laughs> so yeah. And you know, if you're trying to hire someone, I'm open to it. <laughs>